thanks for joining me as you can see here i got a little bit of a lifting situation and i gotta do my nails in a little bit but i am going to give myself a quick fix for the sake of not having to do a whole entire set and also because i'm almost off for the holidays so i want to make sure i just do something to ensure it doesn't pop what happened was i was working on something and i was lifting or moving something and i pushed my hand against the wall and it popped but i noticed it didn't like feel like it was falling off but then the very end there was tip the very tip was open so all i really did here was i uh, gave it a quick rough up on the top filed it out i grabbed some base gel and i laid that down and as you can see here i threw it in the light and essentially all i'm doing is just making sure that lift doesn't get worse because i don't want to have any issues with it popping out so i applied some base gel now i'm gonna apply some builder gel i'm just going to put it right over the area where the base gel was applied because as you notice i didn't put it over my entire nail and i'm just gonna slowly float it on each side and uh, brush it through because I just want it to be flat again I don't want to do too much work so just uh, ensuring it's laid out in that small section um, floating it over top and then I'll probably just brush it out to make sure again I cover that whole entire lifting space this is not recommended on a regular basis, but in my circumstance, needs to be done. I hold it uh, upside down to allow gravity to take effect and pull where it needs to go, and then I set it in the light. But yeah, I don't do this regularly. This is just an emergency circumstance, and it's just going to allow me to uh, prolong the life of this particular nail so that it doesn't... Um, lift out so you see at least it covers that seal make sure nothing else can get in there uh, prior to doing that too I had also made sure you know you wash and clean in the area I'm just gonna take a little bit more builder gel and just place it over top and float it back and forth just to ensure I secured that area it's okay now but because it's such a thin application I just want to make sure I do not have any issues if I happen to bang my finger again. So I hold it upside down, allow gravity to do its thing, and then I throw it in the light. I did speed up this video because I didn't want it to be super long and I wanted to make sure that it was just to the point and you can kind of see how I work on the fly when I need to. So now with the two layers of builder gel, I am going to, oops, ones I need to quickly uh, remove the inhibition layer because it does have a sticky layer after that I am using a builder gel and then I'm just going to quickly rough it up and give it a file to just smooth it down just a little bit it's not like supremely uh, bumpy as you can see from the application there is a little bit of a split there I can probably smooth it out a lot more but it's late and I'm tired so that's not gonna happen but anywho I um, file through real quick give it a little bit of a clean off wipe it down to make sure all the dust is gone and then I'm just gonna take the same brand and apply a top coat once I apply the top coat it will give it back it's little bit of shine you can see that division line there. I could probably buff it out, but again, I'm lazy and it's late and I'm tired. Real confessions of a nail tech. <laughs> this is just a quick fix to hold me off a couple days so I can get to my holiday break. All right, so I'm just taking the top coat and throwing it on, ramming my finger into that light real quick, letting it do its thing, and boom. Um, I'll probably do another one because I have an issue. It's not OCD, but there's something up and sometimes it just needs to be to everything. It just works. And that's just like that insurance of reinforcement for me. Back in the light I go. Quick one, two. Come back out. Remove the inhibition layer and boom, there you have it. So quick fix, y'all. Like I said, I needed to do it just to make sure that lifting wasn't an issue. 
I hope you enjoyed my video. Please subscribe and like for more content. And I appreciate your support, y'all. Stay blessed. Peace out.